another disappointing quarter for Einhorn. Uh, with losses of more than 5% for the year, his Greenlight Capital down more than 18%. The problem for Einhorn largely stems from his short book. In the quarter, he closed out the majority of his short Netflix, reallocated to his short in Athena Health. And in a call this morning, Einhorn says Tesla's gain during the quarter made the portfolio's second biggest loser, even as he says the company's fundamentals continue to deteriorate. Manufacturing problems continue, yet the stock jumped after the CEO promised the short burn of the century on Twitter. Despite short-term production surge theatrics, the company has missed all of its material manufacturing targets and financial projections. Losses at the company are mounting. In the investor letter, Einhorn called Elon Musk, quote, erratic and desperate, highlighting examples like when Musk said on an analyst call that the analyst was asking boring, bonehead questions. Einhorn also said he wouldn't renew his Model 3 lease. This morning, Musk fired back on Twitter saying, tragic. We'll send Einhorn a box of short shorts to comfort him through this difficult time. Tesla, of course, reporting its own numbers after the market closes today, guys. Boring bonehead questions are not cool. What is that? What? That's my ringtone. Boring questions are not cool. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear it. Boring questions. Boring questions. Boring boring questions are not cool. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, it was fantastic, that, that conference call. You just wanted to hear it every, every time, time you got a phone call. It, it's very strange when I'm out in public this and they wonder what it is. Yeah. A, a note to sources like, yeah. continue calling <laughs> MCC so that she can get that as her ringtone, <laughs> ringtone as frequently yes. as yes. possible. Thank you for is humoring money, me on is that. Is money leaving Einhorn's fund? Oh, yeah. And he even, he even uh, pointed out the redemptions in the letter, saying that I understand why you are redeeming. However, he does believe that his por portfolio, as it's currently constructed, is poised to profit in the long run. So, Well, you're wrong until you're right. Maybe he'll be right. Timing is everything yep. in Hutchman world.